Alright uh, guys, so we're gonna be showcasing the Kaguya bloodline today. I don't actually have it, so my friend here is going to be helping me showcase it. And we'll be going through all the mode move, moves, modes, and how much they cost. So the first move, which is kind of a it basically just stuns you. It is not a block breaker though, so Keep that in mind, you can block it. That move is 500k, Ryo. The second move, which is actually a counter, which he needs me to M1 for. So, just like, stone. If someone's spamming long range, teleports it to them. That move is 1.5 million. The second move, or the third move, which is my personal favorite, is kind of like a that it teleports now this one does actually block break but you can still block through it in the attack um now we're gonna move on to the mode which is my personal favorite from the whole bloodline as some black and white from the tin tails got a nice spikes and i do believe it can fly yeah it can't. Oh, yeah. See him shaking. No. So, we'll move on to the Q spec. Just turning into Kaguya's rabbit. I wouldn't recommend it for, like, PvP, though. i do more boss grinding and movement, because it doesn't deal a whole lot of damage. Um, then we'll move on to the Z spec. Now this is something I'd recommend. It drains all four HP, mode, chi, and stamina. It's really good for PvP if you're just trying to get a refresh. And the mode requirement is level 1000. So, yeah. 